I developed this expert system through two basic rules. One was enthusiasm. <laughs> the second was knowledge of what I was doing while I was treating a case. Two basic rules. Yeah. And, and some details now. The Namur University from Belgium, they approached me the people from the university and they said we have done a preparation for seven years with a team of programmers for an expert system to be built on the basis on which we have put in the computer you are interested to make an expert system I, I said no I don't believe that any computer can come out with correct remedy because flat repertorization, you know, most of the remedies, etc. I said, this is, it doesn't work. They said, no, 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 no. It's in order. We are going to program your way of thinking and put it, putting it into computer. They said, well, what is this? <laughs> what is this? Uh, you sell my brain later on, eh? <laughs> Program my brain, then you sell it. Huh? Eh, it's okay, but it's okay. If this works, I will give you the information. What do you want to know? And there was a team of programmers, and they start asking questions. What you will do in this case? What you will do in that case? And I was telling them, eh? how you think? What is this? What is that? Etc. I was giving the answers and they wrote down some mathematical uh, uh, e equations, you know, <laughs> as I was talking. I said, what, what are you writing down there? And I said, okay, okay, you, you, you talk, you tell us. Huh? Why you did not give in this case sulfur that was covering most of the symptoms and you gave uh, like a cyst that was covering there? I explained to them. and. And then, at a certain moment, I understood, more or less, what they wanted. So, this was going on for one and a half year. Eh? And so, in the end, to speed up the process, I said, okay, I will give you the rules. <laughs> so, <laughs> after that, <laughs> I said, okay, uh, you give this and that, and points this, and that, and I gave all the rules, which took one and a half year, which you asked me to tell you now. Okay, after I have given all the rules, honestly, I could not remember myself what I was telling all these uh, times. It was not possible to remember all the rules, but they had written, written them down. So, where was now the proof if this was really an expert system, or yes or no. It was, they asked me, after they finished, bring three cases to test that you have treated. One case of uh, trigeminal neuralgia, I have given verbascum. Huh? But uh, the, the doctor has given me 25, 30 symptoms. Okay, but uh, I prescribe verbascum on three three keynotes, I can't remember now. But I put, up, I, I take this case, I say it's not possible eh, that the computer will tell me, <laughs> will choose a remedy verbascum. It's not possible because there were 17 others before the verbascum. So I took a, a case of Nax vomica and a case of Natrum muriaticum that were chosen mostly on keynotes. Not a, because it was the first. So I think the, the natural muriaticum case had about 40, 40 symptoms, eh? 40 symptoms. 
so, so they tried to put it in the computer. It was, by that time, it was a computer like this door, you know, big door. Like, the computer breaks down, you know, because the calculations were too many to bring out. So it breaks down, it stops. Now what we do, the professor of uh, uh, Namur University is there, the, the students who they do it, the, the associates, the men, the men who had uh, financed uh, this project, uh, myself, uh, uh, the programmers together with me broke down. Oh, we go to the next, <laughs> next room, we open the bigger computer, do, 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 he says, the computer says, this is a case of natum boreaticum. <laughs> I said, okay, maybe I brought an easy case. <laughs> I, said, I said, okay, okay, let's see, put this case. I read the case, the, the symptoms of the case, that I put. I choose verbascum, huh? <laughs> it's not possible. The computer says the remedy is verbascum. I couldn't believe it myself. I mean, how is that possible? How the hell? I mean, out of uh, 32 symptoms, verbascum covered only five symptoms. How is it was possible that this bloody computer will say this is the remedy? In the meantime, when the second remedy was found, the professor said to his secretary, bring, uh, go and bring some pain, <laughs> some pain to celebrate, because he did not believe that out of three cases, two were correct. The third case, we put the third case, it was Nax Vomica, Nax Vomica is the case, with great certainty, because we had certainty values, right, you will see still is there. So it was a great uh, excitement, etc. And the professor says, I could never believe that uh, the system could work. Because if there was any mistake in any place, the calculations will be upside down, will not bring out the real. That means they have programmed, as I have said exactly, my thinking in this repertory. It's not so easy to duplicate and give you all the rules. What I can give you is that one and a half year we met together and I said, okay, if you manage to duplicate my brain, you can sell it. <laughs> like this. Okay. But uh, still, Still, what we were working in 90, it was different than all this rubbish that has been added into the last... Uh, they, they put all these imaginations and all these remedies, and of course, the system is upside down. Uh, what do you say about the Kunzli dots in the repertory? Queensley. Queensley. What dot? Yeah, what is the, dot? Yeah, the, the repertory shows Queensley information. And it's Which repertory? The, the synthesis. 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 And it says that Queensley is a confirmed um, uh, symptom. Ah. Whenever you see a dot, a big dot, ah. it means Queensley. Yes. Queensley, Queensley was. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Okay, he has asked me whether Queensley's information was reliable. Yes. Queensley was one of those people who practiced unicyst homeopathy and was able to give some confirmations or some additions. He was a very good homeopath. 